Ja, 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 This is the only way that you would cross. And you can't go back because after all you've crossed all this. You can't just go back. You're stuck. Four days. Minimum two days. That's the minimum. Like maximum uh, four or five days. If you're lucky you'll just get it in 12 hours. For me, uh, I did get it in 12 hours. But I had to bake. I was like, I've been here for four days. I'm cold and I'm upset and I'm angry and I'm hungry. We've got nothing, my father died, blah, blah, blah. Just so they would like feel sorry for me and just let me in. So, which is very humili humiliating. If you leave the line, you have to go back from the zero. You're stuck again, like you're doing it all over again, all over again, until nothing happens. Police are just not helping, you know, they're just doing nothing. They're just watching, making sure that nobody's crossing the line, that's all. They're just terrible. They're like, they're like acting like you're some sort of a, um, sorry for them saying this, like you're an animal. Like, just go, do whatever you want. They will just kick you out. They don't care if you're a boy or a girl or a baby or a woman or whatever. Why do this? It's a kid, it's a woman. This is the result of war. Even if we were poor or low educated people or, you know, all of that, we deserve to be treated like humans. They, they, they didn't provide us anything uh, until now, uh, um, right now, a anything, no shelters, no trash can, not even our rights, like uh, the, this paper, so we have to wait, just wait, we don't have any choice, we, uh, we can't continue without the paper and we have to wait here, in this area, in this bad area. Uh, I don't see uh, United Nations here, and um, there is uh, one tent for uh, Red Cross uh, there. So I don't see you, UN. I don't see UN. I'm staying in the streets. Yes. Nothing there. No roof. Nothing there. Nothing. Nothing there. Absolutely. No bathroom. No. Uh, I, uh, I'm, I, I have wait there uh, six hours. Yes, uh, no, no water, no bathroom, no food, nothing there. Some people twelve hours. All right. What do you think that uh, we are human being? I think. Okay, yeah. this is a place we organize for the uh, ladies and children who has no uh, tent and home. So we have uh, many, many uh, families, many children, something around 100, 120. Uh, person are uh, sleep here every day, every night, and they, every day they are changed. People goes, people come, uh, yes. And we organize also some food, some uh, uh, water, and medicine, and uh, what they are looking for. Also translation, also what they are looking. When I left home from Afghanistan, I came to Iran by smuggling, so no document there. I came to Istanbul by smuggling, no document there. I came to Bulgaria by smuggling, I was captured by police, so they took my fingerprint by force, and they hit me a lot in my feet with stick, and 
36th hour, Bahar is with me and we were seven others. They stand as 36th hour like this and say, if anyone sleep, so he will be, yes, he will be hit it. So on that time, one of the boys, I never seen him again here. He was hit it a lot. He was sleeping like that. He was standing. It's very difficult. That six hour you must stand. No water. No food. Last night they tiffed my bag <laughs> with everything. I lost my everything. So a lady helped me. Nicole helped me this uh, jacket, and uh, someone, my friend, buy this uh, pantaloon for me. And uh, a lady, Nicole from Netherlands, Holland. She was from there. She uh, advised me to how to go to Germany uh, from Croatia. T uh, bus tickets uh, 10 euro till Croatia. Croatia will free buses to Slovenia. Slovenia will be free buses till Itrish. Uh, I mean Austria. Uh, Austria, there, wherever you want to go from Austria, you must ha have uh, a money to take a ticket and to go there. Just I got this information here and I didn't have information anymore when I was lifting home. Everybody knows what happening in especially Afghanistan, Iraq, Syria. There is a full risk of life, especially for young people. There is bomb blasting, Taliban killings people, innocent people. So from European government, we want to accept and give us asylum in their countries. Thank <laughs> you.